Falcha Accordia. Thank you for taking the time to listen to this presentation about Leaving Cert Subject Choice. During the Leaving Cert, students are involved in 42 weekly class periods. These class periods are broken down by Guelga, English, Maths, a language of either French or German, a student's subject choices, religion, PE, career guidance, RSC, and pastoral care. At Gelklasserachern, your student will have a choice of three other subjects to choose, to choose from to go along with their core subjects. Their core subjects include Guelga, Maths, English, and a language of either French or German. They will then be able to choose three other subjects from a list. These subjects include Accountancy, Business, Economics, Biology, Physics, Chemistry, History, Geography, Music, Art, Construction Studies, Home Economics, and Applied Maths. When deciding which subjects to choose, your son or daughter should take three core principles into consideration. Which subjects do they like? Which subjects are they good at? And which subjects are required or will help them in their future? When considering subject choice and a student's future, there are a few key points that your son or daughter should ask themselves. What do I want to do when I leave school? Do I want to go to college? What course am I interested in? What points are required for this course? What subjects do I enjoy? What subjects am I good at? When thinking about subject choice, it is important that your son or daughter considers the minimum entry requirements for college and university. Minimum entry requirements consist of general entry requirements to the college, university, and specific course requirements. General entry requirements for most universities and colleges require six subjects, which must include a H7 higher level, 06 ordinary level pass, in English and another language and maths. There are general entry language requirements for all colleges and universities around Ireland. In UCD, NUIG and UCC, they require a pass in English and Irish and also a pass in another language for entry to many courses. Nursing, science and engineering are on the exception to this rule, English and Irish only. Trinity College Dublin and University of Limerick require a pass in English and Irish or another language. DCU require a pass in Irish or English. Primary school teaching is an exception to this rule. Primary school teaching at DCU, a H5 in Irish is required to train as a primary school teacher. Technical University Dublin, TUD, formerly DIT, IT Tala and IT Blanchestown, and most other institutes of technology English or Irish is required. Another language is not required unless it is part of the area of study. If your son or daughter is considering a science-based course, it's important for them to be aware of the different entry requirements for the different universities and colleges around Ireland. The science entry requirements for UCD, NUI, Maynooth, DCU, and TUD are as follows. You need a pass in one science subject to study medicine and nursing. A pass in one science subject is required to study science in UCD, UCC, NUIG, NUI Maynooth, TUD, and DCU. The science entry requirements for Trinity College are as follows. Two science subjects are required for entry to most science-based courses in TCD, e.g. physiotherapy, pharmacy, medicine. One science subject is required for nursing in Trinity College Dublin. Geography is accepted as a second science subject for general science. On this slide, you will see the marking scheme for leaving cert exams. Ard Lavelle, higher level, Gnaw Lavelle, ordinary level. For example, if a student receives between 90 and 100% on their exam, they will receive a H1 in Art Level, higher level, and an O1 in Gnaw Level, ordinary level. In order for a student to pass the exam, they must receive at least 30% or higher on the exam. This table shows us the points awarded for exam results in higher level and ordinary level exams. It is important that you are aware 
that if your son or daughter is taking higher level maths and receives a H6 or higher, they will receive a bonus 25 points. Subject choice for the Leaving Cert provides transition year students with the opportunity to choose what subjects they would like to study next. There are a number of factors that your son or daughter should consider when choosing a subject for the Leaving Cert. What college or career are they possibly interested in? What are their interests? And what is their ability and aptitude for a particular Leaving Cert subject? www.careersportal.ie and www.cao.ie are two websites that provide that provide information on college courses. Students should consider talking to teachers about their particular subjects at Leaving Cert and also identify, based upon their data results, their ability and aptitude for that particular subject. During transition year, all students sit the DATS exams. The DATS are an aptitude test that studies a student's verbal, numerical, abstract, and spatial reasoning along with their arithmetic calculation, spelling, working quickly and accurately. The results of these tests can be helpful in assisting students with their subject choice. Aptitude tests do not measure all forms of intelligence and are only can be used as a tool to help assist in the choice of leaving search subjects. When choosing subjects for the leaving search and their future options, your son or daughter should consider these points. No particular career in mind. Choose a balanced choice of subjects. Consider subjects which are essential for courses or careers you may wish to pursue in the future. Consider a third language and a science subject. Consider subjects which may be useful but are not essential for entry to a particular course or career. It is important to be aware that some leaving source subjects have a practical component. This can either be a project submission or a practical exam prior to the Leaving Cert. History, Geography, Home Economics, Art, Music and Construction Studies all have a practical component attached to the course. When choosing Leaving Cert subjects, your son or daughter should not take these factors into consideration. Only nerds do that subject. Picking subjects that are perceived as more difficult make me appear more intelligent. None of my friends are doing that subject. I don't like teacher X. I'll do it because it will be a DOS. Pick subjects that will help you to maximize your points. Once again, your son or daughter will have a choice of either accountancy, business, economics, biology, physics, chemistry, history, geography, music, art, construction studies, home economics, applied maths to go along with our core subjects of Guelga, Maths, English, and either language of French or German. On the subject choice form, your son or daughter will have the opportunity to select seven subjects. If choosing a language, it's important they place this first and proceed to put the remaining six subjects after. After leaving such subject choice forms have been returned, Depending on the demand for certain subjects, students may be asked to fill out a second Leaving Cert Subject Choice form. This form will require students to choose one subject from line A, one subject from line B, and one subject from line C, depending on the demand and popularity of certain subjects. This slide is only an example of how those subjects may be arranged. Therefore, your son or daughter will have the opportunity to choose seven subjects out of a possible 13 if choosing a language. It is important to put the language first and then proceed to rank the remaining six subjects from one to six. All students will receive this, e this form by email and it must be returned by Tuesday the 29th of March 2022.